We are working on our door bottoms. Uh, one, uh, one set of doors is done, is that right? Yep. And we shot those. This is the, the, the other set, or the other door, I should say, one set. One door is done, and this is the other door. And this is the outer skin. Steve, just kind of pull that away and just show us what's underneath there. That would be the, um, the new skin that goes behind it. And we've done some reinforcing here with a nice strip, as well as some reinforcing here. We've learned over the years that when we weld these back in, this tends, tends to be uh, an issue down here, and this whole piece of acreage is an issue, mainly because it warps. And in order to keep it from warping and to give it some semblance of sturdiness, we run a piece of, say, angle iron that we custom cut and weld, tack weld in there to give it um, a good brace. And this is the uh, new piece that we've already welded on, and then Steve is just going to kind of place that up there to kind of show how it goes. And, and kind of, as M. Lagasse says, bam, there it is. And uh, so what we'll do is we'll tack weld that in there. And again, the reason for tack welding is that we're not warping it by running one long bead to it. So all these clamps go on in order to hold it in place. And the welding process will then take place. So looks good and we're moving forward and this door will be in great shape once we're done with the welding of it.